Hey, this your girl Earl from Embracing Reborns. I'm here with little baby Angelina. We're going to get her out of her Christmas outfit and get her put into her New Year's outfit. And the color theme we're going with for New Year's this year is pink and gray. And I'm putting all the young ladies, all my babies in pink and gray for the New Year's. Because number one, pink is my favorite color. And all of them got a lot of pink and gray outfits. And I just think it looks so nice. And a lot of them have sparkles and with the silver and stuff. So we're going to accent them with the pink and gray outfits for the New Year's. Hope everyone had a blessed holiday and a Merry Christmas. And hope everybody have a safe and prosperous New Year as well as a blessed new year get a minute little miss angeline let's get your arm out of this put your little fingers together oops you take her little bracelet off and this is her little baby block bracelet and it has her um name angelina on it and he got the little floating heart. And I had that made for her. Now for anybody who's new to my channel or didn't see one of my previous videos, I say that if you have a hair bowl and see if instance your baby don't have enough hair for the hair bowl, but you have an old headband. Like I had a couple of these clips here. Let me get this off her. And what you do, you just take a solid color headband and just take your little hair bow that got the little clip on the back. And you just clip it to accent the colors that's in their outfit. You just clip it onto a solid headband. And you I made a whole nother brand new headband. And I do that a lot with my girls. If the ones who don't have a lot of hair to clip on, like her hair isn't that um wait a minute. We got that. Yeah, we got the snaps on snap. Um, it isn't that thick and Lord you look so discombobulated <laughs> I mean the go off thing but she has painted hair as well as rooted hair I swear eventually we gotta get her a new body you know she need more stuffing in her thighs and legs as well and see this is the thing I hate it but this is why I didn't want to do a three-fourth limb for my class but when these things get old and wear out, it just looks crazy to me. And all the filling must be fall down to the fit. I'm not sure what's going on there, but we got to get that rectified sooner than later. But um, like I said, I want to put everybody on pink and gray. But she's going to put on solid pink. And this is by Baby Starters. And this is a three month. We have this outfit and... Believe it or not, this is when you shop too much. You don't even realize what you're doing. But due to the fact that I like pink, I actually got the short sleeve version, which is the three month. And I also got the same outfit in the long sleeve version, which is six month. I would like to put the long sleeve on her, but due to the fact she is, um, she has a shorter torso and thing, and I think the six months is going to be way too big. We're going to put the three month on her, and then we'll put her on some low boots to go with it. And even with the boots, we got, um, actually I got two pairs of those boots for Christmas. I showed one on the video and then I liked them so much I go on and get another one because I got cousins who are expecting to have babies and they are telling me they, if they have a girl they come in to repo those boots. So I said, well, I best go get another pair. So at least I can have one for my girls because I really like the boots. And these boots are, I got them from Ross. And I've, I'm trying to look, I just pulled the tags off and I can't remember who they buy just that fast. And I'll find out before I, the video ends. And they're all low fur and they got the little pink for little bowl on the front. And they made out of fur and a little suede bottom. Really cute. 
And this is a size three month by BB Starters that we put in her on. And the one, even though I don't particularly care for the body on this doll, I I love love her eyes. Let me turn her around a little bit. Always doing the most with these babies. Wait a minute here. Always oh, getting tangled up. This is why I need these darn gloves on. Alright, turn you back around here. Got you flop flopping all over the place. Sometimes I have to look back at my own movies and laugh. I say, Lord. You know, you can look at some people's videos and you can <laughs> tell the ones who got biological children. And like I said, when my niece been here and her little, and she's breastfeeding, so the baby had a couple of little blowouts and stuff while she was down here. But she got that baby washed up, dressed, and changed so fast. And I tell her, I be around here doing the most with these darn dolls. And I'm forever sweating, pouring down. I feel like I'm on a struggle just to get these um and then another thing to get the dolls changed I like to keep the um paperwork in the boots to keep the boots straight as well as the tissue to the toe because they're always a little too big for your reborn but you put tissue to the toe and I say even with the flat shoes if you buy the shoes and they too big you can always wrap tissue around the foot to stop the shoe the shoe on the baby to keep the shoe on the baby but as well as keeping um, tissue to the toe. And that'll keep the, sh the shoes on the baby as well. Let's slouch them down. The little socks. Now, what did I do with the other foot? Oh, here it is. And the thing that come out of these way. The little boots look too cute on it. I really like it. And I see a lot of people all on Facebook got their babies and boots. One lady had some pretty red boots for her baby for the holidays with the little stripe but um stockings on. I mean leggings and the boots. It was absolutely adorable. You know. Kensington always wear that little rhinestone bracelet all the time. But in all truthfulness, the bracelet came with her, and I wanted her to wear her own bracelet today. No, I can't find where I set the. I guess I had the bracelet. I set the bracelet down. But anyway, we can move on to her here. And I'm going to pull her up a little closer. She has painted hair as well as finely rooted mohair. Once again, this is downy fabric softener and water that I'm spraying on her hair. Which I like the 3D effect of the hair when you put the painted one in as well as the... Um, The, mo the rooted. And we're going to do this hairband right here. Which I had ordered these hairbands off of um, eBay and they come in. I think you get, I don't know if you get six or eight. I can't remember in the pack. But they come with the pack of brights and you can get the pack of pastels and it comes with the little rhinestone and see that's the only thing when you're doing with these three four zones you got to make sure you do short sleeve undershirts 
as well as short sleeve shirts to always cover the arm. But, however, you got a very, very floppy little baby when you do do the three-fourths on because she is very, very floppy. Now, she came to me with these earrings in her ears, and I'm not, oh, they are just pierced in there. See, because I never, I wasn't sure if they were glued on or pierced on. But, um, I decided to, um, we bought some earrings that I want to change her earrings out to date as well. And we got these earrings here by the children place and we're going to put a pink one on her and um change out those black earrings that she had on for longest and you get several pairs in the pack for $1.99 at once upon a child here in Charleston that they're originally from the children place It says she have on pink. I think we could do these little. I don't know if these little parrots are too too big for her or not. Oh no! Look at there. Look at she got her little pink parrots on. Oh, I really like that on her. Yep, that's the one we'll put on because it matches her little outfit and it looks very nice and festive looking. Mom piece. My other doll ears, Ray don't have hers pierced, and I'm scared to do it because her ears are so tiny. Even though, like I said, they, they bought them. Um, these Daisy um, Fontes kids earrings for Christmas, and I got three pairs of these for Christmas, and and um. I could have put the pink one of those in her ears, but I like these little birds. I think these look kind of cute and festive. And they're different. You know, everybody you see will have the rhinestones and stuff on. But you ain't can see mini babies with the little parrots. So we want to put these little parrots on her. Yep. That is so cute. Tell your aunties. Say hi, little Angelina. Let me put the little... Bobby down and put you up here so they can see you in your little boots and your little holiday outfit. And this is our baby girl, little Miss Angelina. Let me get her zoom into the camera. Sorry about that. Get her in frame. And that's our girl, little Miss Angelina, ready for the holidays. And once again, I hope you all have. A blessed holidays and Happy New Year. Thank you.